So today I wanted to have a quick guide showing you guys how you can set up a Hytale server. First of all, there is the vanilla way of doing things, where you would end up loading into a single player world. Press escape, go to online play, turn this to on. You can set a password or not, and whether or not the copied link includes a password or not. However, as it says, this will share your IP address. So you only want to do this with friends, not strangers. This is also going to end up being entirely dependent on how powerful your internet is. How far are you from your friend? So this is where third party websites come into play for server hosting. And today I'm gonna to show you how to set up a server with Pine Hosting. They were gracious enough to reach out to me and sponsor my Hytale videos. The link in the pinned comment and description is an affiliate link, which means I get a commission, no extra cost to you, but you can also use code Sayushi on checkout to get 30% off your first month. Speaking from my own experience utilizing their services for my Hytale server, they're pretty incredible. They do have a host of other games, but again, we're talking about Hytale today. I would recommend if you don't know exactly what you need out of a custom plan to reach out to Pine Hosting because their support is legendary. Just tell them how many people you want to have on your Hytale server and there you go. But before I ramble too much about their various features and quality of life things like being able to run it from your freaking phone, instead let's go to my dashboard because once you end up purchasing a server with Pine Hosting, you literally start it, copy the IP, and from the in-game menu, go to servers, and add server in the bottom right. Then you can end up putting the connection IP and naming it whatever you want. Then you just double click it and you're good to go. Modding is incredibly easy because you just go to the file tab and go to the mods folder and then just add in whatever jar mod file you get from Curse Forge or Hytale mods. And then you just restart the server and Pine Hosting server restarts are insanely fast. They take like five seconds. But for you nerds out there, you can go and edit the database, the scheduling, what users have what control, create a manual backup. But the easy config is gonna be the main thing for most players because this is where you'll end up setting your server name, message of the day, whether PVP is enabled and whatever else. And most importantly, this is where you'll set up your password. Thanks again to Pine Hosting for sponsoring today's video. And if you want more quick to the point tutorials, be sure to subscribe because I've got a lot more planned.